Hello dwellers, my name is Dan or Cayman Films and welcome to another Minecraft video. Today, we're not going to take any damage. Or at least that's what the map's called. It's literally called Don't Take Damage and we're above eight kind of evilly inspired rooms uh, that we're supposed to apparently find a kind of button. Like, here, here's the rules. Play a normal, one player, sometimes you may die twice, so yay. <laughs> Play an adventure, find the button on each map. Command blocks are enabled and have fun. It's a very, very simple map. This is the first map this guy has created. Uh, so we're going to check this out, but this is going to be really cool because this is a cool idea. So we have half a heart and we literally can't take any damage or we die. So we're up here in a tree. We got to find the button. So what we got to do is I'm guessing we have to sprint jump into this pool of water from here. So. Oh, I missed it. I have taken damage. I got that. I understand. <laughs> All right, so we just have to really, really try our hardest to uh, make the full... Oh! We just gotta aim into that pool. That's the, uh, that's the whole prerogative of this particular level. Man, if I'm gonna fail this badly without, you know, even any hazards... Okay, that time I didn't jump. I gotta land in the water, that's all we gotta do. <laughs> But it's a very, very specific distance, and you have to make it exactly and aim it correctly or you're just going to die. Which is a big bummer. So, let's try this one more time. I feel like this is going to be it. I feel like this is our, uh, this is our swan song. Yeah! I was right! Okay, press the button. Now we're on level two. Okay, so... We just have to go through the cactuses without dying. Doesn't seem that hard. Just have to find the stupid button. Found it. Bam! That was easy. Level three. There's lava here. We're in a small cave system and I believe the button has to be somewhere pretty close by. We just have to do some parkour around here. That's what it looks like. Okay, the easiest way to parkour would be to jump here to there. There's, there's a little overhang that I'm going to have some problems with. But, uh, I think that's where the button is up there. I can't exact- oh, ooh, that scared me. Uh, <laughs> I can't exactly see for myself, but I, I think it's over there. So let's just try our hardest to make it. And, obviously, I'm going to fail the parkour because... <laughs> Caveman's biggest strong suit is definitely not parkour. It, it's, it's really not. I have the, uh... The reaction time of a dead cat. Okay, so we're going to do this again. There we go. And we got to be really careful. Okay, there we go. And then we got to do a corner jump up. Yeah, there's that sneaky button. Okay, so then we have to. Well, that's a. Is that an impossible jump? That seems like it's impossible to me. I, I, I feel like it, it's because it's one block above and so maybe I have to go there but that seems impossible too unless I can uh, I can maybe well you know what it, it's no use trying <laughs> oh man okay let's try that again though okay so we're here you can just jump you can just Fall and die. This is a very smart map though. I like the idea behind it. It's really, really cool. If it didn't take so long to respawn, that'd be great. Because I don't like the, you have taken damage respawning. Wait as everything gets set up and you have to take like four seconds to actually get back to moving. Oh boy. See, now that I made the jump, I'm going to keep on failing it repeatedly. And that's just what's going to happen. All right, come on. All right. There we go. There we go. Okay, we're back here. The button's right there. And I don't know if I'm supposed to jump this way or towards that. But either way, it seems like you need to get it exactly or you're just going to fall and die. Like that. Ugh. Very, very tough. Very tough parkour going on here, and by that I mean I, again, have the reaction time of a dead cat. So, every time I run off the stupid block, I don't press the spacebar in time, and it's very obvious. Okay. Oh, that time I failed over there. 
My finger actually did slip off the keyboard that time, but uh... All right, let's do it. Let's do it. We can do this. Come on. You think this is for babies? You think babies can do this? They probably can. They're probably better at this game than you, you freaking freak. You make me sick. Oh, no, you fell in the lava. That was a random lag spike. That was weird. Okay, let's try this again. Let's not try that again. I want, there should be like a total of how many times you've actually taken the damage at the end of the course. That would be smart. Be like, hey, you suck this much. Oh, I hit the stupid block on my head. Ah, uh, okay. So I got the whole game plan. It's not that hard. You just kind of got to do decent parkour timings, stupid block over my head. You know, you could have been very nice and just not put that there. That would have been kind of you, you know. The, it's already kind of annoying enough. I didn't, I didn't really need your input with that block. But I guess you have to make it even more frustrating because you're a sadist. Okay, so. There we go. We're here. We're great. Oh man, okay. Let's try this one more time! Oh! You literally have to wait until the exact frame <laughs> you're about to fall off to jump. Oh my goodness, okay. Ah, stupid block. Welcome to Caveman Cut like 30 minutes of footage to give you this episode. Okay, ah crap, that, that was embarrassing, I'm not gonna lie. That was embarrassing. Okay, come on, jump here. Jump to there, die. Ah. Okay, boom. Okay, fail. If it wasn't for the respawning, again, it wouldn't- Ah, oh, okay, so my game crashed. That's also weird. Uh, <laughs> and I, I guess it put me up here. I didn't, Jake, I didn't jump up here. Um, but when I signed back in, I was right up here on this corner. So, I, I don't know what happened. I don't want to make the jump, though. <laughs> if you, you want to count that as cheating, I don't care. But I've spent literally 40 minutes on that, so we're here at level 4 now. Okay. What do we have to do here? We have to not take any fall damage, seems like. Well, we definitely took fall damage there. Okay, so, again, it seems pretty easy. I just got a little big for my riches here. So you don't want to jump. You just kind of want to do that, and then you can just... Ah! Trick me! Wait, how did I die up there again? Okay, whatever. You know what? I can play your game. Okay, right here, right here, right there. What I get caught on, that that was uh, very annoying. I don't know what got me. I actually don't. I guess there was probably some sort of spider web. Oh, I got caught on that. Okay. I don't even need to. Yeah, I do. So I do need to jump. Hmm. Well, this is definitely a kind of puzzle map, because you have to figure out how to get through the course. That was scary. Okay, so we just have to do this. We're here. Okay, cool. Good for me. Dang it! You gotta jump around the corner there. Okay. You know what? We can do that. We're fine. We are perfectly fine. Oh, crap. I, uh, mis <laughs> mistook the, uh, the correct way to go. Okay, where are you the correct way to go? Oh, you are the correct way to go. Why the heck? What? Okay, there, there is something really screwy going on. Okay, come on. You're the correct way to go. There we go. Coming here. Do a theater near you. I have to jump around the pillar. Um, I turn into a motorcycle when I get angry, by the way. 
Uh, <laughs> okay, so... I hit my life. Why did I die there? That wasn't fair. Yeah, I gotta make sure that I'm actually doing the right one. Just this one. Uh, okay, bam. Basically, it's just parkour through the course without taking fall damage or you die. And here's the thing, if I jump... Wouldn't that... that would... First off, I didn't get any momentum at all, I don't know what happened there. But if I jump, wouldn't that be making... That'd make my fall damage happen too, right? So I'm like... Ah, oh, what the heck, I touched the bar for like a second, but still... This is a mean map. Like, I I honestly feel like this thing's beating me up for my lunch money every single time I play it! Okay. Listen, map, I don't got no more money, okay? You already took my quarters. I can't I can't afford my milk anymore. Oh. This is just a very, very If this is level Oh great. Ah, uh, my mouse. That's the other thing. Guys, don't ever try recording a parkour video with a non-responsive mouse, because that, that doesn't go well. Doesn't go well for anyone. Okay, so jump. Sprint jump. Sprint jump. What am I supposed to do? If I jump, I feel like I'm going to take fall damage, but if I don't jump, I won't make it to the stupid thing, so... Yeah, you see, I landed on it! I landed on the dang block, I took fall damage and died! That's a bad. That, you're evil. That is literally evil. You should feel really mad at yourself, Mr. Map Creator. That- that is beyond... Get me out of here. <laughs> Alright, so. Level 5. We're in a cloud. And we died from the cloud. And then we died when we spawned on the clued. Alright, so we need to get a clued. On what we should actually freaking do. Hmm. I mean, that block right here is higher. But I don't feel like... Yeah. What, what am I supposed to do? Because I can't land on that. And there's no higher blocks! What the heck am I supposed to do from here?! Like, I legitimately don't see anything that can save me. Oh! You are evil, 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 evil! You are so evil, it's not even funny. You should be ashamed of how evil you are. I bet even Satan would be like, whoa, this guy is really freaking evil. I could never top this guy, because I found out there's some water right here, which you have to literally precision jump into. And I thought the other precision jump was even, <laughs> was bad. This is definitely a telling of things to come. Oh boy. The best part is, if you do manage to hit the, uh, the water, you might accidentally touch a cactus and die. Or, you might accidentally get yourself, uh, roasted in a pit of lava. Oh. Oh. Oh, ah! Just like that! This is a mean map! Why is this map so freaking mean? Okay, we're here. What does that sign say? I don't trust it. You've been griefed, XD. Yes, you have, you freaking evil man. Okay, there's a tree here. Oh. Yay! Okay, level six. What are we supposed to do? Can we break anything? Oh. Oh, we get to drown. That's nice. Okay, come on. You're not gonna give me any air, are you? You're not giving me any air! Evil, evil, bo evil. Yep. Yeah, I really do wish I could figure out why that was getting me. Okay, so we're down here. We just have to find the stupid button. And that stupid button... ...has to be somewhere... You'd think- oh. 
That's a chest. Key. Wait, so I got the key. What's the key go to? So I have to go into the chest, get the key, come back out. Yeah, I got the key. I'm gonna die though. Yep. Yeah. Alright! I'm- I'm on your game now. I got it. I got to the chest, key, whatever. This game is like basically forcing you to figure out how to play. Woo! Okay! We made it out. I got the key. What's the key go to? The key does not tell me where to put it. It's a tripwire, isn't it? How's a tr just because a tripwire looks like a key doesn't make it a key. Okay, whatever. Uh, we got some coral here. So what do I do with said key? That'd be that'd be good to know, you know. We got to go back for air. Um, I can't place the key anywhere. This is a very very mean and spiteful map. Give me air, please. I'm just looking around for where I can put the stupid key. Sponge? Wait. I guess I needed to open the chest with the key to get the spo- I- I don't know. But we solved it! I'm guessing we have to make this jump. And then we gotta make this jump. And then- uh. I'm sure you have to make that jump, but there's no way to, because the button's right there, I see it. Oh boy! Yay! Okay! <clears throat> I shouldn't be this mad- OW! Why can't I- Put out the fire! <laughs> if I could put out the fire, give me a bucket of water, this would be so much easier. Alright, so... Man, I wish I had, like, extendo arms. Oh boy! It's easy in theory, hard in practice. Just like Cards Against Humanity. Okay, come on. Day 37, and the stupid... Why am I dying before I'm dying? Uh, this is a very evil map. Have I said that already? I, I don't think I have. I don't think I've stated enough. This map is literally now the spawn of Satan. Okay. If I could just push that fire out right there, <laughs> I could I could I could I could do it. There has to be a better Oh my god, I did it! Okay, cool. Level seven complete, level eight, final level. Well, if this is a final level. I fail. Okay. Maybe we should take a look at our surroundings before I just run or er, just jump. So there's the end down there. Oh, I see exactly what you want me to do. Okay. Okay. Then we can just drop around here, very softly, very... Do we jump it to the end? I don't trust it enough. I guess we do! Okay. Downloading terrain. Taking a very long time. Oh! Jump up. Okay. Whoa! Whoa! Go this way. Okay. Now what? What do we do now? Okay, we go this way? Yeesh! That jump! Okay, and then, uh, I guess we go down. Oh, You little, little, little boy. You, you little evil. 
Evil thing, you. Yes, you are. You suck. You suck a banana. Okay. So let's go back into the end! And all we gotta do... Is... <laughs> try to fall down that well a little easier than before. At least we don't take fall damage from our gigantic Mondo jumps anymore, which is nice. Okay, so I think I can just position myself even better if I jump. Yeah! And I guess we're getting the credits here. I can't skip it, can I? No. Oh, there we go. So congratulations, we did it! We have won! That was really, really annoying and hard, <laughs> but we did it, guys. So hopefully you enjoyed my my utter pain. Talk to you guys later. See ya.